Uh, let's finish up. Wyoming. The Wyoming Cowboys. I love this. I love Craig Bowl so much. Six and six last year, four and four in conference. Returning starters, they got four on offense, five on defense. Number six most experienced in the Mountain West Conference, number 77 in the country. Craig Bowl, 28 and 35 in five seasons. Uh, remember, he was otherworldly at North Dakota State. Uh, he may be the best player developer in the Mountain West. They won their last four in 2018 to get to six and six. Uh, quarterback Sean Chambers, he uh, sparked a late season rally before he broke his right fibula. Uh, he looks the part, and I think having him is going to make them significantly better. The offensive line is young. They got no depth at tackle, uh, tackle though, so they're going to have to do some big-time development there. Uh, number 19 in total defense last year. Tons of experience in the front seven uh, and in the secondary. Look, middle linebacker Logan Wilson. This dude is awesome. Absolutely awesome. You need to watch him this coming season. Uh, he'll end up being an NFL guy. Offense finished number 119 in total O. That's out of 130 teams. Number 119 in scoring offense. Quarterback Chambers should improve that. Road games, though, look, we'll talk about the schedule. Uh, they got road games at San Diego State, at Boise, at Utah State, at Air Force. The team should be good. Um, but I don't think that they can improve significantly on their record because of the schedule. So we'll, here's, here's what I'm rolling through. They got Missouri at home. But spoiler, I like Missouri a lot this year. <laughs> yeah, they've so, still got Missouri at home. Yeah, right? so it's, it's Missouri. So okay. I, I've got them losing that one. But then I've got wins. This will be kind of the exact opposite of last year. I got wins at Texas State, Idaho, at Tulsa, and UNLV. So they open up 4-1. and one. Great, right? Well, then you get a bye, and you go to San Diego State. I think San Diego State's going to be pretty good this year. I've got a loss there. But then I've got a win over New Mexico and a win over Nevada. So, you know, at that point, 6-2. and two, Looks like a pretty good season, right? Well, then you got at Boise State, at Utah State, Colorado State, and at Air Force. Three road games in the last four all against pretty good competition. I I got them 7 and 5. Which is still pretty good and I think makes a bowl. So 7 and 5, 4 and 4 in the league. What you got my boy Craig Bowl at? I got him 5 and 7. That's totally reasonable. I just think the the injury prone of the quarterback, the big injury, broken bone, I know people think broken femur is a little bit different. I, I well, just, it's a fibula. Fibula. But, okay. Yeah. All right. I thought it was femur. But anyway, um, then then also just no depth on the offensive line. Yeah. If, if guys go down and you've got a quarterback that's coming off a knee injury already, a leg injury, I, I just wonder what what happens to this team. Oh, yeah. Well, especially late when it gets a little more difficult. You know, I, I, I've got them winning the, the toss-up games, but I've got them losing the, the most difficult. So and basically every game on the road after uh, after October, so it's, it's tough. It is very very difficult. All right, you guys know what to do. Go to winningcureseverything.com. Go to betnow.eu. Subscribe on YouTube. All the wonderful things. We'll see you guys next time. Thanks for checking out Winning Cures Everything. If you want to keep up with us, hit subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. Visit the website at winningcureseverything.com or you can like us on Facebook or follow us at Winning Cures, at Gary WCE, or at Chris B. Giannini on Twitter. Share out the show, leave a nice review, and make sure to comment and tweet at us.